Greetings, brothers and sisters of planet Earth. This is your brother Patar, Jabba Patar here. And your brother Jabba Patar is going to talk today about an issue that a lot of people were going around and we have a misconception about, about it. And this misconception about it is I want to put it straight that when we say mutinoid, mutinoid does not mean deformity. It doesn't mean that you have poliomyelitis and you come down with a deformity or a birth defect and you come down with a deformity. That's not what mutinoid means. Mutation of the black woman is what bring all of the race here and that's what I'm talking about mutinoid white folks came from black folks when black folks mutate other race come about hmm? what race are you talking about well when we're talking about race we're either talking about that which have a beginning or an ending are when speaking about a segment of the family of man. Now, the Negroid is called Ethiopian. And those others who are called mutinoids call themselves Anglos. Now, so we have race, that which have a beginning and an ending, are race when speaking about a segment of the family of man. Now in the family of man, the original man was the black man. Now, those that came out of the black man are considered mutation. They are called mutinoid. Not deformity of lips or deformity of nose or hand. Are the farming of, uh, of, 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 of posterior. Posterior is not what we're talking about. High or low. Okay? So let's just get this straight. Okay? Now, people are going around and saying a lot of things. Now, people are going around and people are saying that mutation of limbs is what is called a mutinoid. Quite the contrary. And what we are talking about is very important in the world around us today. Because in the world around us today, you have one section of the people who they call black people, and they have another section of the people that they call white people, and they have another section of the people that they call Latinos, and they have another section that they call Arabs, and another section that they call Chinese or Haitian, people from Asia. Hmm? Japanese, Chinese, Indonesian, you name it. Right? Now all of these I'm talking about are they're these Chinese, Japanese, Indian, and these names along the way. They have two people who they identify that one is black and one is white. And the mutinoid is a white one. And the black one is the original. Hmm? You can get the recessive from the dominant, but you cannot get the dominant from the recessive. And that is what I'm talking about here. So the misconception is going around with deformity and claiming that deformity is a mutation of the black woman gene into other race that's not what I'm saying I am saying is that the black race 
is the one that produced all race on the planet. Hmm? That's what I'm saying. So, let's not get carried away. You understand? Into nonsense. Hmm? Please do. I'm not saying that because you're a mutinoid and therefore you're wrong. Are you right? I am saying is that the mutinoid are the one who are the conquering race of the world and have racial boundaries that you got to cross. Whether you are in the United States or you're in Europe. The only place you don't have to cross racial boundaries is in Africa. And now the Arabs are over there doing it. And they claim, well, we are white too. Look at us. Hmm? So, they claim that they are Persian. Well, let me tell you this. The Persian are black. The original Persian are black. You go look in history and you will see the Persian archers are black. Go look at it. It's not mutinoid. Huh? Africa will go all the way up. The African beer takes you all the way up into Persia. The African beer. Go look at the map of the African beer. And you will see. With the iron legs standing on the land of pot. Stretch all the way into Persia. Past the Persian Gulf. The front paws. Hmm? Go look at it. The map is there for you to see. You have it on your phone. Hmm? So we know that Philip of Macedonia was a mutinoid. And we also know that Zeus were mutinoid. So let's start taking away and talk about deformities mutinoid. And that's what the issue is today. We are not here to confuse or to fool the people. We are here to speak the truth. And speaking the truth is what Jabba Pata is doing. Blessed be Ra. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha.